What's up guys? Today I'm gonna be making homemade brownies completely from scratch. No cheating here, 100% healthy, don't worry about it. But honestly, the only reason why I'm making this is because I recently got my period, which means I don't have a baby in my womb. So I'm craving chocolate more than I normally do. So I'm just gonna make some box brownies because guess what? I couldn't be bothered to try and make them from scratch, but you know, maybe when we're doing a little bit better, I will do that, maybe, I don't know. But, um, if you've never had Betty Crocker fudge brownies, they are my favorite brownies, really of all time. Um, I've been having these probably since I was like two or three years old, and we got the two eggs, some vegetable oil which also doubles as canola oil so that's fine oh i have to get water well that's fine okay and then i have my pan and i figured I may as well just make some content while i'm making some brownies so we're just gonna get into it like i'm sitting only because i couldn't be bothered to go get my tripod so obviously the constant mood of being on my period is just laziness and not just not being in the mood. I can't deal with it. I just do whatever. And I also have to get a wooden spoon, but that's besides the point. So we got a half cup of vegetable oil. If I can open it, that'd be great. And I genuinely do like baking and cooking, but today I just couldn't be bothered to try and make them homemade. That would take a little bit too much effort. So I need three tablespoons of water. Spoon, the literal like only thing that I actually need. Um, and then we'll just do this. And I was thinking about trying the Annie's brownie mix, but that was a lot more expensive than the Betty Crocker one. So, eggs are so gross. I love, I like eggs, but like they're gross. Like, that's so weird. And not a single shell. Am I five or am I 20? I don't know. Which it's really weird to be like eye level with this because most of the time I'm completely above it. The reason I don't even want to try to make homemade brownies today is because it takes so long because you have to measure everything and there's like actual specific instructions like first you have to combine the dry and then you got to take the egg and I've never actually looked up a recipe for it so that could be completely different right I did everything this seems really freaking dry this is a lot denser than I remember it being I haven't had Betty Crocker brownies and I wouldn't even be able to tell you how long. I swear. Probably preheat the oven. Now that we preheated the oven, I am going to grease the pan with butter. I think if I were to do another one of these, I probably would get my tripod and actually try to like make it okay, but Today we're just not gonna be bothered. That's not me actually singing. I'm sure that someone will probably think that, but that's really false. Here to get the sides. I, are you supposed to also flour this? I don't think you're supposed to flour it because it's not in the direction. So I'm just gonna go with my gut feeling. Ooh. Man, I love making homemade brownies. I love being a grandma. Wow. Thumbnail. I never actually even take my thumbnails like that, so I don't know why I try to be like fun and quirky. Is it quirky? No, it's definitely quirky. Quirk? I don't freaking know. This is riveting. Honestly, it really truly is. Look at that. That's all nice and level. Oh, what the f Oh my, I am getting brownie all over the counter. But that just gives me a reason to eat it. 
which I'm gonna eat it anyway. My sister actually gave me this idea. I'm just gonna add some white chocolate chips to literally like one brownie. I'm gonna be putting, I think they're caramel. What is it? Yeah, caramel flavored chips. So yeah, I think I did everything besides bake it. I'm gonna put them in the oven and then come back when they're done and when I'm about to eat them, so yeah, yeah. Okay, this really isn't a smart idea, but this is just what we're gonna do. Woo, we did it, yay, 19 more minutes. Honestly, if you don't like eating the raw brownie batter, I don't really wanna be friends with you. It's so good. How could you not wanna eat it? How could you let it go down the drain? Honestly, I don't know. I just want to say I only ate about a spoonful of the brownie batter. I'm a responsible adult. I don't want to get salmonella. As I was washing my bowl, I remembered that I had a video to edit and it's what I eat in a day to lose weight. That's gonna look a little uh, problematic, but I just got my period, I think I can just let my cravings be happy for one day, and sorry to my body, so I can have a brownie if my body wants a brownie. So it's been 30 minutes and I'm just going to try this little tiny bite. These will always be my favorite box brownies. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully it was a little bit entertaining. I don't know. I do want to make more of these videos, but not from like box products. So let me know down below what you guys would want to see. And yeah, bye.